All right, good morning, everybody. What a crazy week it has been here on the channel, at least. I hope you guys have enjoyed all the videos lately. They've certainly been a lot more entertaining with what's going on in the market this week and got another good one for you today. But before we get into it, don't forget that ISW Intensity Stock Watch, the scanner that I use to find all of my trades, even though I don't trade it, even how the blueprint is to trade it, they are having a 65% off sale of their entire biggest package, the team package, which even includes the uh the chat rooms every scanner and the learning center which which teaches you uh the actual blueprint of how to trade uh what the scanner's built for i don't trade that way i trade obviously how you guys see but if you want to try that check out that link down below use code gdtisw VRCA 150K. VRCA. Yeah, VRCA here. It is in danger of halting, but I'm going to go ahead and get it started here at 40 or at 476. Just 200 shares. Taking it a little bit easier because it is in halt territory. All right, looking for under 460 for a partial here. Can it get down there? Four sixty holding. Can it break four sixty? All right, I'm gonna just take the whole thing right there on that quick move here in VRCA. And it kind of feels strong, and it was getting towards the point where I would have had to think about not adding in and just cutting it if it went up through five. So I'm just gonna take that for small little win. I'm gonna go ahead and get some started here in Iova. In at eight forty two. See what it does. All right, can it get down under eight? 30. There's 831. There's 830. And we got under for a second, so I'm going to put my order out. I got a partial fill there of, what's that, 85 shares? Okay, so there's the first 100 out. See if we can get this thing moving back down a bit lower here now. Another hundred out at eight twenty-one, and then the other hundred. Oops, cancel. Hundred out at eight. 21 and then 811 kind of the targets i'm looking at here for the remaining 200 shares getting close to 821 two cents away on the bid see if you can get down get me a fill here one cent away on the bid about one cent away on the bid there for a second. Trying to get this next hundred shares out here on IOVA. Okay, there's that down to a hundred shares here now on IOVA. Let's see if it can get down even further. Final target currently being 811. Okay, I'm going to put a stop in just now up at 835 here. So I'm guaranteed to be in the money. On these last years here on iova we'll just see if it can get down to my 811 target there or not be an okay little win if it does two cents away here on the bid can it get down there and all out so i'm happy with that trade it was a little bit weird and slow moving but hey i'll take it hey here comes the 330s can it get up to the 330s watching it All right, I'm going to go ahead and get started here. LDI, I'm in at 339. See what the sucker does. See if I can get uh, add in. Okay, add it in there at 349. Now I have 600 shares here. LDI. 
And at 343 on the average. So you can get back down under the 340s. Okay, gonna get down here, watching it. All right, gonna take my partial right there. Down to 300 shares now. See if we can move down a little bit further. Okay, here comes 330. Can I get down under 330? There's 330. Okay, gonna take another 100 right here. Down to 200 shares now. Even get down towards 320 here. All right, can we get down a little further here now in LDI? All right, gonna see if I can get another 100 here at 323. Got that, okay, down to 100 shares now. What I'm gonna do here is just put my stop in up at 336 on the rest, and I'm gonna try and let those sit, these 100 shares, and see if maybe it can start giving this move back because it's super extended on the daily chart. All right, we've made another little leg down here, so I'm gonna bring my stop down again to 321 now. So locking in a guaranteed few more dollars and we'll see if I can keep rolling. All right, I moved under three, so I'm gonna move my stop down again now to 311. So the trail is working out pretty well so far. Hopefully it can keep going. All right, pushing down towards 290 here. Gonna bring my stop down even more. 297 now. All right, I'm continuing to trail the stop down here. Getting a little bit tighter with my trail, but that's only because I need to get out of here soon. And it's worked out very, very well. Can't complain at all right now with this LDI trade. All right, am I gonna finally get taken out here on LDI after an hours long trade? Any fill here to the upside should get me taken out. And I can't complain at all. Not one bit. All right. Fully taken out there in LDI in that trade for almost a straight hour, making $113 on it. And over half of it came on the remaining five or one six of size of that trade. So finally getting a really nice trail in there. And I think that's going to do it for me. That's a really good way to go into. So there you have it, everybody in that LDI trade for almost an hour. I think it came out to 59 minutes from my first entry to getting stopped out there for that last 100 shares. I actually was thinking about holding uh, just a small size for like a swing because the daily chart is uh, super overextended. And actually my mentor B, the guy who built the scanners told me, just leave 10 shares on. It's a really good bet. Just leave 10 shares on and you know let it go for a few days. But I never listened. So I took the whole thing off there because I didn't want to be thinking about 10 shares over the weekend, which is dumb, especially on a $2, $3 stock, but it is what it is. Overall, made $200 today. Can't complain about that. Really good comeback. Uh, the last two days after getting that broker buying power screw job issue on Wednesday. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you hit like and subscribe. The channel starting to get a little bit of momentum. Also check out my other uh, channel, Whiskey Tears, if you're interested in whiskey, bourbon, scotch, all that good stuff. I'll see you guys next week.